know, set rules. And I think that's what's so wonderful about my life is that I don't think there has to be a, a black and white. I don't think there has to be a division between work and free time. I'm Brinda Somaya, architect, urban conservationist, woman, mother, grandmother, and a citizen of India. This is a pleasure to have this conversation with IndiaArtInDesign.com. When I was much younger uh, and my children were young, uh, I was building up my practice. Things were very different. And looking back, I often wonder how I did all what I did. I guess I did bring up my two children, Nandini and Vikram, reasonably well. My son. He's a free spirit. And so because he's far away, it's much easier to be forgiving. Nandini has been very... Uh, uh, a lot of moments with her have been cherished by Anand and me together. You know, Anand and I, of course, have cherished moments. We've been, we've been married now over 40 years. I'm not the world's best grandmother because I'm still working. I try my best to spend time with my grandchildren. I get them over to the office sometime and take them out for lunch when they're on vacation. I love to travel and we've traveled the world, literally. So when I travel with a family or with friends, we make a deal that one third, one third of the time we sightsee, one third of the time we eat, we're all foodies, and one third of the time we shop. I love to eat, but I'm not interested in cooking. Cold food, I don't like food cold, I like hot food on the table. Uh, we're very non-vegetarian, I enjoy seafood. Yeah, um, uh, maybe I'd like to lose some weight. <laughs> uh, I've never worn synthetic saris. I've always worn cotton or silk, um, natural materials. I've never counted how many I have. I don't intend to, but I give a lot away, trying to ease my conscience when I buy a new one. I, I really don't have a favorite color. I like organic colors. Um, I tend to wear more beiges and blues and greys and a little more sober colours and everyone gets bored and they say go and wear something bright. Saturdays and Sundays I do not wear saris just because mindset I like to think I'm on a, on a break. But I'm not one of those who's all the time thinking about what I'm wearing and how I look and what I, you know. <laughs> yes, because I have short hair and I think I like earrings, yeah, yeah. So I do have traditional cork jewellery and typical South Indian jewellery. But to work, travel, I'm very happy with <laughs> my silver. And what's fun about silver jewellery is you can keep changing it, you know. I read, uh, I enjoy television. I think both of us uh, unwind with TV. We watch Netflix. We're usually watching some sort of a serial, some season something. So we get to watch one each day, so that's good fun. I enjoy that. So success comes out of uh, a combination of many different abilities. And I think in my case, or an architect's case, it would have to be certainly a combination of hard work, of determination, of creativity, of belief in oneself. But most important, you have to love with a passion what you do. If you believe you're your own success, that's enough. Everyone can't be a big grand success. But if you've loved what you've done, then it's a life well spent.